started this fellowship 10 years ago with uh, one saying from Swami Vivekananda who said, give me a thousand good men and women and I can change this country. And our whole thing was, can we create those thousand good men? There are so many talented young people in this country. Can we do a systematic process by which we select them, we groom them, we induct them, we help them understand the grassroots reality and then let them out into the nation. So for me, these graduating 165 are part of that thousand vision of Swami Vivekananda and that makes me feel extremely happy. We were the first fellowship in this country when we first went out to colleges and started selling that young people should get involved in development. People didn't quite understand it. We were probably a little ahead of our time. But uh, increasingly it's become such a norm. There are now more than 20 fantastic fellowships in the country to engage people, to get involved in grassroots issues. And so I think it's exploded. At that time to get 10 people seemed impossible. But now I think some total between all of us, there must be over 1,500 or 2,000 people getting involved in development issues in India. I think there's been a huge increase in the number of millennials who have joined the development sector. I think that's for two reasons. Uh, one is millennials want a career of purpose. They're no longer willing to sit behind a desk and do a job just for the sake of a designation. Uh, they want to see a life of meaning. I think they're an extremely different generation from my generation or my father's generation. Uh, so they want these new things. And if the market is there and they want it, I think more and more people are leveraging to find out how to make it possible. The key thing in our experience to generate a social entrepreneurship is not the ability to create a business plan, not the ability to understand finance, uh, not the ability to do organization development, not that. But really the key is understanding the customer deeply. Most of us have lived urban lives and don't understand the rural consumer, rural customer, rural beneficiary, whoever you want to call it. Fellows have gone on to take on multiple roles. Some of them are starting their own enterprises, social enterprises. Some of them are joining government jobs. Some of them have joined corporates to go back and you know, they're looked at as uh, value-based leaders in corporates who are sensitive. Some of them have gone on to study in both India and abroad to go and do their masters. have joined the best universities internationally, Oxford, Cambridge, Harvard, Stanford. Any of these schools uh, loves to have these fellows because they have real grassroots experience. Some of them join NGOs as well to actually go and extend their knowledge uh, even more in this area. So there's a whole range, right, from corporates to CSR to NGOs to academics or even starting their own enterprises. Mm -hmm.